Uh, good morning, Britain. Um, it's time for video report. Now, do you know who's got a short, stumpy funnel, a short, stumpy boiler, a short, stumpy dome, and a very special friend called Annie? No, no, it's not Nick. It's, it's another equally lovable little character, Thomas. Yes, Thomas the Tank Engine, the Reverend W. Audrey's immortal steam train, hero of countless delightful books, and now the star of his own smash hit TV series, golden moments of which have been brought together on this, my uh, first video for you this week, okay? If you're weary of the travails and troubles of this war-torn world, you can escape now into the magical world of make-believe with this lovely video. And, of course, it is make-believe. The trains here run on time. <laughs> and, and every story has a happy ending. Look, here's a snatch from one of them. The narrator is Ringo Starr. What happened then? No one knows. Perhaps they forgot to couple Thomas to the train. Or perhaps the driver pulled the lever by mistake. Anyhow, Thomas started. As he passed the first signal box, men waved and shouted. But he didn't stop. They're waving because I'm such a splendid engine, he thought importantly. Henry says it's hard to pull trains, but I think it's easy. Hurry, 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 he puffed, pretending to be like Gordon. People have never seen me pulling a train before. It's nice of them to wave, and he whistled. Peep, peep, thank you. Then he came to a signal at danger. Bother, he thought. I must stop, and I was going so nicely, too. What a nuisance signals are. He blew an angry peep, peep on his whistle. The signalman ran up. Hello, Thomas, he said. What are you doing here? I'm pulling a train, said Thomas. Can't you see? Where are your coaches, then? Thomas looked back. Why, bless me, he said, if we haven't left them behind. Mm, in my view, that's the way to run a railway. I think they should make the Reverend Audrey chairman of the rail. <laughs> of course, I'd love to have seen Enid Brighton as Prime Minister. Wouldn't it have been marvellous if Britain could be like Toy Town? No strikes, no unemployment, perfect racial harmony. Mr. Plod and Golly were often seen holding hands. Anyway, that is my daydream. I've been a closet noddy for years. But enough, you're quite right, of my political beliefs. Back to video report. 